Well, well, well. We're back at our our big. This was our our big fence job that we did. And uh, obviously the conditions have changed. I think we played everything right. I really do. I think we did a really awesome job uh, predicting the weather and doing what we did with the hustle and the crew. And the helpers. Because um, now there's snow. And believe it or not, this takes a lot of extra energy extra energy let's let's go look we'll go look at this one it's a lot of extra energy to work around this so i'll show you a little boo-boo the contractor did that now i gotta fix in the snow and uh it's really not that big a deal but it's just it's still it takes it takes effort um the gates are all looking like they're snowed in Nice and cozy, look at that, huh? Nice and level. I'll pat myself, pat myself on my back. I do good work, I try to. Anyways, so let me flip the camera here. So they had a backhoe in here, and you can see the backhoe snagged her. Yep, she snagged her good. So it bent it all down, no big deal. But I'm telling you, these twisties, mm, they don't let go. They don't let, oh man. I better bring more fabric than I thought. This is all stretched. That's stretched. What else? Anything else stretched? No. So I probably better bring a little chunk of that stuff. It looks like it bowed all this stuff down. But anyways, now look what I have to deal with. I have to deal with snow. It's not the end of the world, but yeah, I just still I have to. Garage doors are here, but they're not ready for us now. They're putting wood. We'll take a look on the inside. I see what's going on. I uh, I wanted to stop by here. I was hoping I could park the trailer in there. I basically, I got the trailer at my house, my personal house, because we're out of room. And uh, we keep getting this dump of snow. And uh, Uncle Dave doesn't like having to clean off his trucks. See how they get full of snow. Takes an extra time in the morning to clean them off, get them fired up, everything. So I'd like to be able to park in my garage, but because when you're a business owner, everything dumps on your lap. Let's see what you can see in here. Can you see in here? You can see better in here than I can, actually. The camera's doing a better job, but it's, a, it's just a war zone in here. It's just everything. They filled up this big building real fast, a lot of equipment. Um, You know, there's just tons of stuff. There ain't no room for a trailer. My trailer's darn near all 30 feet long with the nose and uh it'll just be in their way i mean i could un i could undo them i could undo them and put them here but you know you look at this and you go you know how it is guys right if i set it here they're gonna work right there and then stuff's gonna fall on it or they're gonna drive over it with this big old piece of equipment or the forks the forks are gonna go through it and then it's going to be damaged. And then with everything going on right now, it'll take six months before I can even see, see them, before I can even get replacement sections. <sighs> oh, they got a new Skyjack. You want to check it out? Let's check it out. Let's check out this Skyjack. That uh, looks pretty new to me. I wonder whose this is, huh? Whose Skyjack is this? So most of them, not all of them, but you know, 32 inches wide, 19 foot tall for platform. Hmm. That almost makes me want to fire it up and see if it's herky jerky. Maybe it's not that new. All right. Eh, it's just got a little crusty on it. Let's try it out. Let's see if this thing's all herky jerky, huh? Let's see if a brand new one is. Let's try it out. Let's try it out. That's if it'll run. So I got the key in it. Does this thing got power? You got power? Don't tell nobody that I'm doing this, okay? Uh, all right, let's check this out. All right. Oh, no. no. That's not looking good. That's not looking good. Nothing there. That's off. Oh, I think I just turned. Oh, that's not too bad. Oh, it's kind of nicer. See, the newer ones must have a... Oh, this thing's way slower way slower 
This thing is way slower than mine. So there you go, boys and girls. A Skyjack. The new ones probably are not. What, what's this? The horn? Horn don't work. Why doesn't the horn work? Hmm. Surprised the horn don't work. No, that's smoother. That's way smoother. Oh, there we go. Maybe we'll just buy another. Maybe we'll buy a new Skyjack. Wow, that's pretty nice. Well, that's not bad at all. That's not herky jerky. Wheels turn. Everything runs slower, actually. And make sure the battery's not. Oh, well, it's draining down, but mine does the same thing. As soon as you hit it, see how it drops. But mine does the same thing. But I can feel it. it. It definitely feels a lot smoother. Not bad. Not bad. I mean, I think there's ways that Skyjack gets around the cheaperness. You know, like uh, you know, for instance, there's a genie lift right there. We'll check that out in a second. But they got these pins. You know, that you just put in for your slide for this thing to slide out. So. Not bad though, not bad. We gotta, we're gonna have to probably upgrade ours eventually here. It's just, uh, you know, it's got that major, it's got that switch down there for the kill. That's killing your battery right there. Got your normal charger, which I've had all kinds of issues with mine. It's all fixed now, but not bad. I'm glad that's here. I'm glad I got to check that out for a second. That's pretty cool. And the wonderful genies. Oh, I love the genies. This one's not bad. See, this one, where's the numbers on it? Where is the numbers on this genie? Oh, here we go. Well, oh, I don't think that's it. I think that's somebody else's. I don't know what this one is, but it looks a little bit... I normally go by the steps. If it's a three-stepper, yeah, it's not a three-stepper. But, you know, genie's got like... I mean, they got some nice features. Their controller's nicer. They got the foot peg that helps extend it out. Um, I don't know. They're just nicer, I think. But... Depending on if you're going to buy a new one, which I think our next one's going to be a new one. Um, because of all the liabilities and just stickers and paint and tires and these things just, these things can be just uh, monsters. They can add up. You're better off, uh, I almost think you're all better off just keeping your old one and use it on a sparing. And that's what this builder does here. I think you're better off just keeping it i mean sure if you gotta sell it to make you know to pay for the new one that's fine too but you know we've been we've been we've been so busy with a lot of commercial that we are having the problem that we almost need a second lift um so we might come down to it and uh it's really hard because like our trailer and that it all works but it's you it's on the verge of not not working so you gotta have that uh new stuff to jump into and you really got to go or got an emergency or whatever and then the other stuff is kind of like you limp it along it can be there sparingly it's just to get that guy kind of out of out of a bind so well anywho i'm getting out of here there's uh no reason to stay here anymore this place is uh this place is full so we're getting out of here and it's uh just before the new year's so i want to wish you a happy new year's and it's been a crazy year i don't think 2021 is going to be any better i hope i'm wrong so anyways shout out to you guys happy new year's have a good time be safe don't do anything crazy behave and we will see you on the next one see ya